If you are looking for a way to minimize your chat box or just your stream in general on Twitch or I would assume YouTube as well, then rest assured I'm going to be showing you how to add this amazing sideways chat widget which is right here below. So let's go ahead and get on into the video. Hey guys, real quick before we get started, I'm GS Fear and I'm a content creator on both YouTube and Twitch. And if you're looking for some stream tips, tricks, and tutorials, then feel free to hit that subscribe, that notification ding ding, so you don't miss any more like it. And also I do stream on Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday on Twitch. Link will be in the description. So let's go ahead and get on in with the tutorial. So what you're gonna wanna do first is go to streamelements.com. Just in case you haven't created an account with them, you're going to go to sign in with your Twitch or whatever it says on the main page is very easy to follow. You're going to click the my Twitch. You're going to go to my dashboard. And then when we get to this page, we're going to join the stream elements discord, which I will leave a link to that in the description as well. And once we get to the stream elements discord, we're going to come down here to the widget chair and click on the minimal chat by Mr. Boost, who is an amazing content creator on Twitch as well. Thank you so much to him for making this and approving me making this video as well. So you're gonna click on this link right here, the streams.net minimal chat by Mr. Boost. This is the sideways chat. So once you do that, it's gonna add it to your overlays. So what we're gonna do then is we're then going to go back into the stream elements dashboard and then go over here to my overlays. So once we get to the my overlays, we're going to go to the sideways chat, which is going to be created. We're going to go to edit. So after we get into the edit, we're going to double click on the sideways chat, go to the settings. And now you have some fields. So show nickname every message. You can click that yes or no. So if you don't want every single message that you type to have your nickname right after it, you could click no. You could also hide the message after a certain amount of seconds. I like mine to kind of stay on it, but you can change it to 30 seconds, 45 seconds, whatever you really prefer. They even have a really cool animation out. There's a whole bunch of different ones you can set it to if you want it to hide after a certain amount of se seconds. There's also a uh, use Nutty's font. He has like a custom font added into it if you really want to use that. It's another amazing content creator on YouTube and Twitch. So I will leave a link to his as well in the description. You can also change to whatever font you want to use. I like the monster rat. Sure, I'm absolutely butchering the name of that. You can change the font size. You can make it bold. You can make it thin, light, regular, medium. Really, really easy. You can then change the font color, the text shadow if you want to. I've mostly left these kind of how it is. You can change the background color. I like mine to be mostly transparent. So after you do that, there's going to be an ignored users. If you want it to ignore any bots that you have or specific people, if you want. But after we do all of the settings that we want and we're happy with, we're going to click the save button and the copy URL button. We're just going to click on that. It's going to copy it to your clipboard on the bottom. So then what we're going to do is we're going to come back over here and we are going to go into our OBS, which is right here. And then you're just going to add it as a browser source. I like mine to be 1920 by 1080. I feel like that adds the correct text size without it being too small or too big and just kind of weird looking. So it's as easy as that. Let me know in the comments if you have any more issues or you can catch me live on Twitch if you need any, you know, stream tips, 